It's your girl Roxy. I am here in Jamaica, Montego Bay, Jamaica. Me and Kelly are on our honeymoon. We just got here, it's our first day, and we're just relaxing right now. We're actually waiting to get checked into our room. I came to Jamaica with a pixie cut for the first time. Um, usually I have either braids or a wig. So we're gonna see how this journey goes. <laughs> but yeah, we're here in Ibero Star Grand Rose Hall. Um, it's a really beautiful resort. I still haven't seen my room. I've just seen the like the outside and the lobby, but so far so good. Okay, I'm still in the same clothes that I wore on the plane. But I can't wait to go inside and just you know wash up, unpack. Um, and just show you guys around, let you guys know what we're up to on our honeymoon. Not too much though, we kind of want to relax a bit. But yeah, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new. And I'll definitely do a get ready with me um, on vacation in Jamaica for you guys. basically on top of a glass that's upside down so i'm doing the best i can because i did forget my tripod iphone stand everything but we are going to the pool um i'm just putting on a little bit of, a little bit of cover up because i do feel um just a little bit blah so i want to bring myself up a bit i showed you guys some of the room uh, i wasn't like super impressed but it's still nice it's a nice resort we're a little bit in a sour mood because it took us a while just to check in. We came around 11.30. Our check-in was supposed to be at 3. And then um, we got into the room at 4. So we were just over just hanging out outside in the lobby. Hanging out outside. We wanted to go and take a shower. Um, um, unpack our stuff. So Kamar was a little bit frustrated. I was a little bit frustrated. We ended up going into a room that wasn't originally ours but apparently it's the same room but it's on a lower level still ocean view um and the same layout so i feel a little bit better the butler did come by just to let us know like what's included and what he can do for us during our stay <clears throat> yeah so i came to jamaica with a pixie guys i think this is my first time in jamaica with a short haircut so i'm really trying i just came out the shower i had my satin scarf on while i was in the shower i didn't want to get it drenched because i can't dry it but i did bring um my blow dryer guys all right guys so this is the attachment i got it from the beauty supply store there were two like there was another one i just went with a cheaper one i'm gonna link it below for you guys so if you're traveling and you need like and you don't want to carry your, ho your hooded dryer you can just use this so you just put the attachment right here I'm gonna plug it in quickly um my hair is not super wet so i don't need to dry it but i'm just gonna show you guys so you put it on like this and then you pull the drawstring and then when you turn it on it's gonna blow up and you can feel the heat coming through the back and all around Okay, 
so it just blew off because i didn't tighten it properly but you guys get the idea um it's gonna save me so much time and it's easy to travel with that's how small it is camera kind of dozed off which is good because i'm not gonna feel super rushed um we have dinner for 8 30 we're going to do like a hibachi um, i'm gonna wear a swimsuit guys i'm so kind of nervous i haven't worn a swimsuit in a long time when i was trying them on i didn't feel super confident because you know like i did gain a little bit of weight but i do have a cover up i'm just gonna put it together and see how i feel so guys i'm using the maybelline um 30 hour foundation this is stay active foundation in the color 360 mocha but it's looking like it's finished went to the beach and yeah we were in the water for a bit it was really nice really warm salt water <laughs> anyways we're gonna go for dinner soon so we're gonna go inside and get ready um we're gonna do hibachi tonight so we're, we're gonna go get ready now rinse off and just change in to our clothes so we can go in have dinner i brought my uh half inch flat iron because i want to curl my hair I want to style it, it's wrapped. I just took a shower, I didn't get it wet, but I just wanna bump it a little bit just to give it some character. So I'm gonna do that first before I put on my makeup because I wanna tie it down while I'm doing my makeup so it can just set. But guys, I seen about three, okay, one, two. Okay, I seen at least two other girls on the resort were rocking pixies i know like it's possible it's maintainable so i'm just gonna like whip through my hair and kind of just touch up my makeup and put on my clothes and we're gonna get ready to go Okay guys, so we're ready. I decided to take the satin scarf off because it was kind of damp and it was making my hair wet. Um, but I think it came out so cute. I warmed up my makeup a bit and I like this new lip combo that I'm using. I got this lip gloss from the hair store. It's called... Um, so the color is called White Lie and it's the Ruby Kisses Butter Balm Gloss. I don't know if you guys have seen this in the hair in the beauty supply store before. It looks like this. 
anyway so i just lined it with some dark brown liner but yeah so um i'm just wearing these thick gold hoops um this gold necklace i got these accessories from winners i just go into the winners and i just find their accessories that i like and i buy them i also got this bag from winners this beach bag it was on sale too i think it's very cute it's a cute size can hold a lot of things has a lot of space and it's very beachy even though we're not going on the beach it's still giving vacation vibes um and i'm wearing this black um kind of slinky dress uh it's very snug and i'll show you what the back looks like i got this from winners as well so the back is looking like this it's kind of dark i wonder if i can give you guys a better angle let's use Callie's mirror all right so there you go the back is looking like this so really sexy and then the front is looking like pretty normal so it's a nice mini dress so this is my outfit for tonight i'm going to show you guys my shoes as well i got my shoes from h&m so they're like the espadrille style it has the gold buckle and it goes with my gold accessories and it goes with my beach bag so h&m i got these there we go that's much better i'm gonna see if i can get a nice cute photo All right, so before we leave, we're just gonna take. Woo! I want to record that. Take a... I didn't, it just flew off as soon as I. Oh, oh my God! You guys hear that? We get to to our honeymoon and to our new journey as married couples. As a married couple. It's 9.30 there. Oh, it's nice. And it's still bright? Oh, I dropped the whole thing. This is actually kind of fun. some room service we're gonna get some fries and burger burgers the wings were done we're not hungry but we're eating why not it's good okay so we went to so after our hibachi we went to we went outside and we listened to like a performance it was like a show right 90s 90s theme yeah 90s r&b theme after that we went to a disco and then yeah we just yeah it wasn't it wasn't our vibe. It was more entertaining because people were acting crazy. Like, anyways, spin whatever. The bottle and Adults were playing spin the bottle. Jumping and dance. But whoever the bottle spilled, sp spun on, they were supposed to go in the middle and dance. And also, like, they were doing, like, limbo and, I don't know, some type of limbo. But, it, yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't like a party. It was, people were being silly, basically. So anyways, we came back to the rest, to the hotel room, just having, having some champagne and also we just ordered some food. So we're gonna eat, find a movie to watch. Good morning, it's the next day, we're having breakfast. So we're gonna bring all of our breakfast outside. Yeah, so we're gonna eat breakfast outside on the balcony. Um, for some reason, the lens keeps fogging up every time I come out here so it might get a little bit foggy because it's really humid out here there we go
a hash brown toast, oatmeal, scrambled eggs, bacon. All right, guys. So we are going out. Where are we going, Kelly? Outside of this room. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go outside of this room. We're probably gonna find some water, like a beach or a pool. We we're gonna try to walk over to the other resort. But I just wanna show you guys like what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this. Um, light green highlighter green bathing suit comes with the underwear of course I'm wearing a cover that I got from pretty little thing the swimsuit is from Ardeen and the these slides here are from pretty little thing I'm wearing this um, button-up shirt from H&M I just put it over it's really light and sheer I just threw it over just in case I need to cover up while I'm walking through the resort so yeah, this is what I'm wearing, guys. And oh, Kelly, come, come, not come, no man. We're not matching, but babe looks really good. Um, he's wearing his shirt from Zara. Zara shorts. <laughs> this is not my bag. This is really good. <laughs> <laughs> he's holding my bag. Um, you guys saw that bag yesterday, but yeah, we're looking cute. We're looking all festive. Here, more festive. We're, we're looking like vacation. Okay. Alright guys, this is our second day in Jamaica at the Beer Star. Is it called Rose Hall Grand? Yeah. So this is my first time in like chlorine water. Yesterday we went to the beach, which was really good. So exciting, but yeah, I just feel so relaxed. I just spoke with the kids. They're with my mom and their grandpa and my sister. They're taking care of them. Thank you. Like I feel at ease. Before I left, I was kind of nervous because I don't know, I just never left my kids. Uh, have you left them yet? This one? Yeah. No. And the last time we went to Mexico, we brought them with us. So, but I feel so, like, I don't feel worried or anything like that. Yeah, as long as if I work night shift and then I come home and you, you take them out to go somewhere, it's what I, like, I haven't seen them. Oh, but you know they're with me, that's right different. There. I mean like me and you away from them. No, I've never. Yeah, and they're the not they're not in our care. In our care, not just me. I'm sure you're not worried about them. But you mean like you miss them, kind yeah. of? Them? Yeah. They don't miss us. Yeah, they don't miss us. But anyway. Because they're comfortable. Yeah, they're comfortable. Cassie's having a blast. She loves my mom. But yeah guys. 
<laughs> day two with the pixie. I think I'm gonna wash it today before dinner actually because um, yeah, it's kind of stiff. I have so much hairspray in it. And I think I have time. We have dinner reservations today again at like a surf and turf. So it's gonna be like steak and trim, you know, that kind of vibe. So yeah, I'm excited to get ready for that. And then yeah. But anyways, obviously I'm gonna show you guys like everything that we're eating, everything that we're wearing, and all that stuff. So yeah. But yeah, we come over talking yesterday. Come here, Kelly. We were talking yesterday, and then I was saying, like, this inspires me to, like, want to travel more. Like, what's next? Hi. How you doing? All right. How do you feel about that? What's next? Yeah, like, traveling more and stuff like that. Yeah, I'm going to start planning some stuff. Yeah. With and without the kids. Yeah, we're going to do some more traveling with and without the kids. Next but actually, with the kids. Yeah, I actually think they would like it, like, in Jamaica, like, on a kids' resort. Yeah. In and out of the pool when they want. Yeah. Yeah. They would love it here. Michael Mike loves to. Michael would live. Michael would be dancing, no? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mika. When we in the Mexico was it Mika? Yeah, Mika. Mika, Mika. Yeah. Mike could be the star of the show. <laughs>
okay, I'm gonna try it and if I can't try it, then that's it. But it sounds pretty straightforward, no? Yeah. Bike looks like this. And it's pretty much just gas, this button here, and brake in here. We just came back from ATV riding and planning. It was so, it was just something new. It was thrilling, it was scary at first, but we got through it. So now we're just back at Jam West um, where they do all the experiences and we're just eating some food. All right, so we have salad, we have jerk chicken with jerk sauce, rice and peas, curry chicken, fried chicken, jerk chicken wrap. And it looks so delicious, I cannot wait to eat. We are starving, guys. Okay guys, so the shirt is from Zara, shorts are from Zara, purse is from, and the shoes are from Winners. So this is what your girl is wearing. Yes. Chicken. Stew fish. Stew fish, everything. We ate so much. Well, like, no, we didn't eat a lot, but we had many different things. And then we had this green juice that they have at the front. And when I tell you guys it's a washout, it's a washout. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's so we're feeling the effects of that right now. But we're laying by the poolside under a cabana. Um, it's pretty early, but I think we're still gonna go on the water. Right? Yep. Yeah. I'm gonna go change into my swimsuit so we can go in the water and just play some music. 
um, and just relax. That's what we came here to do, relax. Um, hopefully this vlog is good. Hopefully you guys are getting a sense of our honeymoon, but still with, um, not still with, but we're still enjoying our honeymoon without, you know, over vlogging. Right, Kelly? Yeah. yeah. That's what I meant to say. But yeah, I'll see you guys. Bye. All right guys, so we're gonna go swimming. I put on my pink bathing suit. I got this bathing suit, I think like two years ago from Shein. I think Sani bought it for me. And some pink slippers. Yes! Ladies and gentlemen, I just wanna tell you guys, this guy is representing for all Jamaican, all black people that can't swim. <laughs> you are a new national hero. Listen, worst of all, you're not even saying you're black American, you're black Jamaican, you know we can't swim. That's why we're not in the Titanic movie. Because they know we can't swim. So, what's your name? Michael Phelps, he said. Yes, yes, Mr. Phelps. From? St. Elizabeth. Come on, people. The hey, guys. It is our last day on vacation. We are at our same spot by the pool. And I'm wearing the same swimsuit and set that I was wearing maybe two days ago, so you guys will see that. But we weren't expecting to stay an extra day, so I don't have an extra bathing suit. <laughs> but anyways, um, our flight got delayed one whole day. So we're gonna be here for one extra night for free, of course. So we're super grateful for that and mom, mom is okay with that so i don't know we're just trying to enjoy it this morning we were kind of stressed out because like we want to be home but everything is going to go just fine but anyway um last time we saw you guys we were at an italian restaurant the food was so good i enjoyed the food did you it was okay what okay that calamari was, was good calamari was good okay that was my favorite one we had i had a lasagna i had tenderloin steak and some appetizer that I haven't tried before. But it was super good. It was one of their a la carte. So it wasn't like a buffet style. It was really good, guys. Um, I definitely recommend this resort if you want to come and have like adult-only relaxing vacation. But then you also get a bit of fun if you go to the other side. So I would definitely, definitely recommend. This is the Iberostar, Star, the Grand Rose Hall Park. Rose Hall Grand or something. Um, but anyway. But that's what we're doing right now. We're just chilling out. It is hot as hell. Probably just going to go in the water maybe in like 30 minutes or so. I'm still trying to like share content on my ponytail page. So I'm kind of working a little bit but not too much. Um, but still like it doesn't seem like work at the same time. But yeah, hopefully you guys got enough footage of our honeymoon. We did a lot in my opinion in terms of like we did excursions, we got to experience the beach, the pool, the food, which was really good. Um, it was just enough for me. Not too crazy, just enough. But I don't know, how do you feel, Kelly? Right now, bittersweet. Bittersweet. We got an extra night, extra day. Yeah. But I also wanted to be home at this time. What time is it? Like at this time, yeah. we could have been home. Yeah. Enjoy the rest of the Sunday with the kids. Yeah, we definitely miss our kids, but it's just a part of being parents but anyway <laughs> um yeah the food was really good really really good the best restaurant was the, the jamaican fish yeah there was a jamaican a la carte it was really good yeah i would definitely recommend this resort very much all um, the staff is really nice really helpful they're friendly engaging and everything the entertainment at night like perfect Whew. Anyway, guys, I'll see you guys. Um, I don't know in the next clip. Bye.